Hi everyone. This is another update I'm doing on this on the spot welder Malevic. It's from a company from Germany. And uh, it came in so quick. I was surprised. This is the this is this is the this is the name of the company and this is where you can buy it. If you buy it, if you're in the US, you buy this thing. And uh, less than a week it covers it will arrive in less than a week. They charge you fifteen dollars for shipping. Okay, so this is the instruction. It's in Dutch and a different language. So this way, if you go to the website, you can, there's a bunch of stuff you can do. And I was able to put it together. And <coughs> excuse me, I was able to put it together. Well, I noticed a few things. I did about uh, two, three spot welders, but today I'm gonna do the back of this as long as he can continue to work. And I'm gonna do a strip of this. This uh, this the strip is is 0.2 milli, milli, millimeter. So now let me turn it on for you guys to see. Okay, turn it on. This thing's up, and it's, there's no button there. There's no button to turn it off, turn it on. Once you plug it, when you when you want to be when you want this thing to be unplugged, you just you see this button is for to choose the menus. Okay, there's several menus, there's batteries, there's poles. So let me see, shots poles, auto poles. Let me see the auto poles. Delay, active. So it's delay and active, I don't understand this, but anyway. You see what this thing's showing you here. So I'll put it in exit. Oh. What's delay? 0.3 second. I need this thing to be a little bit faster because let me just to print. Let's see, we're gonna try that. But the battery tells me it's it's almost empty. I do not know why he says this. This battery is fully charged. The battery is fully charged, but you tell me almost empty. The body is telling me it's almost empty. So the body comes for let's check what the body is look like. I have to plug this thing in. The body look like okay. Let me turn the camera you can see. I have no idea what this thing says. Let's see, the battery is 11.6. The battery is fully charged. This thing tells you it's 11.1. The battery is fully charged. I'm not sure why this thing tells me the battery is not that great. Now, this is says battery alarm. I gotta lower this thing because I need. Uh, that's the only thing I can do. I'm gonna bring it to ten. Oh, this is higher. Bring it to ten. See if it can work. See how long it works. Okay. So let's see what happened there. Time to do some spot welder. Okay. So I'm gonna move the camera in a way so it doesn't get in my way. I was trying to set the the camera in a way so you can see the spot welding. So let me remove those. Remove those. Okay, now let's do some spot welding. I think I had to put the camera in front of me. I'm gonna do, right now I have this strip, which is not done. That's the rest of it is not done. I'm gonna do the rest of it, trying to do one uh, one strip on the camera. You guys can see how it works, how this thing works. Hopefully it doesn't take that long. Okay, here you go. I don't have no gloves, but I think this is fine. So, okay, ah, not bad. I'm still jumpy. It 
sometimes if this thing is not set properly on the right spot it's not leveled so that's why you got to clean the top of the body you see you got to clean them make sure they clean so they don't do a huge spot okay so usually for this thing not to do too much spot uh spark so you just put one first and here's the other one there we go just put one and the other one so let's go one, another one. One. There we go. This this is not settled properly. It made loose spark. What well, it doesn't. Whoa. But it's well done. It's 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 pretty good. This is pretty good. Now the body says to say something else. I'm going to show you the battery in a few minutes after I finish the strip. Oh boy, here we go. If the battery is clean, this, it won't do too much spark. If the battery is dirty, it will do you spark. And the speed is not bad at all. The handle would be nicer. Huh? But this is pretty nice. But it's still good. But it's still good. Let me show you guys the battery. This is not warm. This is not bad. So I have a working spot welder compared to the scrub I bought from Chinese. I'm not saying anything with Chinese units, but some of this doesn't work. They don't they copy the stuff. You can't copy stuff unless copy the code. All right, this is so good, man. Then again, this cost, this thing costs about $160 to get to US, shipping included. That's what happened when, when the battery is not clean, it does this. This is not bad. Hmm. This is perfect. This is so good. But it's still good. I just did another strip. So I'm gonna see I'm gonna do some more. Okay. I'm gonna do some more. So yep, yeah, you can see it. I'll do this one first. This is the body I'm doing. I'm putting in production, so I can't remove the strip to show you it's not working. This is going straight to production.
the noise you hear is the fan, the 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 spot welder has. It has a fan on it. Oh. <laughs> But it's still spot welder because the thing slipped in my hand. But it's still not coming off, you see? It's not coming off. It's not coming off. Just for the first time I see one just remove because the strip pop up. Let me try to put it back. I just saw one of them come up because the pressure. Because some of the batteries, for some reason, they shorter. So I'm continuing. I think I had ten. Some of the bad, some of the, some of the bad is uh, too dirty. Should I have this as nine? Like I lower it. I think I should put everything at ten, because that's what I used to do it. Ten is fine. So I don't like that when you think give you too much spark. So the higher is stronger. See, I don't like to, the spark is too big, so that's why I'm lowering it. Yeah, I lower it. I don't like too much spark, but for the first time I see this one, this this one just come off. I think this will be fine. This is not sit properly. When they don't seat properly, they fight, they, they spark a lot. See? I don't want this one to spark. If you don't seat properly, it will spark. That's why you have to clean the battery. So if some, of the, some, of the, some of the residues left on the battery, it's not a good thing. But the spot where it's working, as you can see, it is working. It's working. So far I did, I think I start from here. I did one, two, three. I put two, two spot, two, two, two weld in each, on each batteries. This is a hundred batteries, probably start here, that's probably 50. From here and there, it's 50 times. It's 50 times, times two will give you a hundred weld. And I just went back to the same battery. I don't think the battery is moving any lower and down. I noticed the the wattage, the wattage on the battery is changing. Okay. The wattage, he was saying. I don't know if you guys can see this. It says uh, 120, 125. The thing was at 80 earlier. I don't know why it's increasing. I don't know why, but anyway. This smart welder is actually doing the job. I'm gonna pause the video, completed it hopefully, and show you the way it looks like when it's complete. Well, I don't think my body gonna allow allow me. Let me finish those welds, hopefully. Because it's not sit properly. Every time it doesn't sit properly, it does a lot of spark. Something seems to come off. 
it's not coming off. Oh, I forgot one here. Oh well, I'm stopping the video. And as you can see, this thing is working properly. I keep it at 9. I don't want it 10 because I don't like too much spark. My body is not clean enough. So they look, they look tight. Um, this looks good. I'm, in, I'm ending the video now, right there. It's 16 minutes, so this is good enough. I'm going to do more video like this to show you the spot where it's always working. This pack is going to be finished tonight. It's about 125, 126 on the Saturday morning. I'm stopping the video right there. So guys, this is not bad. I have several body to do like this. And I'm sending, I'm testing this and ship it home. The home is with Haiti, so I have a lot of about a 2000 body in Haiti. Need to be weld. I couldn't find a spot welder. I found this, it works. I think this is good to go. I'm gonna keep testing it, but there's a few things I didn't like. There's no, there's no button to turn it off. So I didn't like that. So the display, I bought some other stuff there. The overall, this is doing the job it's supposed to do. Okay.